Welcome to Grayon Math. We are asked to solve this problem. We have this quadrilateral A, B, C, D, and inside this quadrilateral is a circle, a blue circle tangent to three lines of this uh, quadrilateral at point G, E, and F. And it is given that the basis of the trapezoid I, or the quadrilateral uh, is the base for the lower is twice the base of the upper and the length of the segment uh, AD is 15 units while for BC is 12 units and at point B and point C are uh, right angles perpendicular to each other okay and we are required to find the length of uh, X Okay, so first is we drop a line from point uh, A down to CD and it should be perpendicular and we label the point as the point of intersection to CD as H. Okay, so next is we label this length DH as uh, 2M minus M. So 2M minus M. This is DH because the total is uh, 2M. And we need to subtract this HC, which is M. So this will be M for the, val for the length DH. Okay, so since this AH is uh, parallel to this BC and is actually congruent since this is a projected line parallel to BC. So this is actually 12 units also. And we need to focus on this triangular. AHD so this triangle so the hypotenuse is 15 and this uh, one leg is M and one leg is 12 units so by Pythagorean theorem we have uh, uh, M square plus 12 square is equal to 15 square so uh, x square or I mean m square m square is equal to 15 square minus 12 square or 225 minus 144 that is m square so m square is equal to 81 and if we take the square root of both sides so we have here uh, M is equal to 9 units. Okay, so next is we project the radius from the center to point E. And from the center to point F. So this is R also. And from uh, center to G. So this is 12 also. And those at the point of tangency, though, these are actually perpendicular, and so with this, and this, and this, and this. And if we project a line from this, uh, uh, this uh, center to the upper base, so this will be uh, 12 minus r. And since this is R from this point to this point, this is R. So this length shall be 9 minus R. Okay. Okay, so next is we connect the point A to the center of the circle. And since at this triangle this is actually a uh, perpendicular so this right triangle here has a length of 9 minus r and 12 minus r and for this triangle here so the legs are x and r and they have this uh, common hypotenuse at the center from i mean the length from the center of the circle to point a so let's call this as uh, uh, H, small letter H. 
Okay, so the common hypotenuse is h square so is equal to h square. So for this right, I mean the left right triangle, we have the uh, x square plus r square is equal to this uh, 9 minus r square plus 12 minus r squared. Okay, so let us set aside this equation first. x squared plus r squared is equal to 9 minus r plus 12 minus r squared. Okay, so let us consider this first. So this segment AD. So the segment AD is 15 and has a portion that is AG which is x. So this segment G D gives us a 15 minus x and this length so this length df should also give us a 15 minus x because they are uh, at g and f are tangent points and their external tangent is at d and if we add this 15 minus x plus r okay so this gives us the uh, total length of the segment cd so cd is equal to 15 minus x plus r so cd is equal to uh, 2m Okay, so 15 minus x plus r. But 2m or m is equal to 9. So 2 times 9 is equal to 15 minus x plus r. So this gives us 18. So 15 minus x plus r. So uh, r is actually 18. Uh, minus 15 then plus x because you need to put this negative x to the right and 15 becomes negative 15 so r is equal to x plus 3 okay or we can also say that x is equal to r minus 3 Okay, so going back to x squared plus r squared is equal to 9 minus r squared plus 12 minus r squared. So since uh, x is r minus 3, so we can replace this x with r minus 3. We square that plus r squared is equal to 9 uh, minus r. So we square this binomial 81 minus 18r plus r squared. So plus 144 minus 24 r plus r square. So we can square this also, this binomial r minus 3. So r square minus 6 r plus 9 plus r square. And we copy. So 81 minus 18 r plus r square plus 144 minus 24r plus r square and we cancel the r squares there is 2 on the left and 2 on the right so we can cancel that okay so if you put the r's on the uh, right hand side to the left so we have 18r plus 24r then copy negative 6r is equal to uh, huh? this gives us 81 and plus 144 then we need to subtract the 9 from the left so on the right left it gives us a 36 r is equal to 216
And if we divide both sides by 36, so divide by 36. So R gives us the value of 6 units. And now for the final step, so we just need to find the value of x. And x is equal to, as we have represented earlier, x is equal to r minus 3. And x is equal to, since r is equal to 6, we just substitute 6 and subtract 3. So we have x is equal to 3 units. And that is our answer. So thank you for watching until the end of the video. Please like the video if you like our solution. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon. So you will be updated for more math videos like this. Thank you. Bye.